Whoa! That looks really good. Is it gonna stop? Is it gonna stop? Hi, I'm Colin with Colin TV, and today we're doing another McDonald's maker. The McDonald's Happy Meal Magic Drink Fountain. I think this is going to be really cool and really fun, and I'm ready to test it out. Now let's make some McDonald's Happy Meal Magic Drinks. It has McDonald's logo on the front. It says McDonald's Happy Meal Magic Drink Fountain. Make delicious thirst quenching drinks that look like McDonald's drinks. It says easy to clean and easy to make. Kool-Aid included. Step 1. Pour in 12 ounce of juice and drink mix. 2. Press button for jet spray action. 3. Push a cup against the dispenser lever to serve. And on the back, it shows you what it does. It says push for jet spray action, handy cup dispenser. The drink comes out here and cool accessory holder. I love opening old toys and this one's from 1993. So this is going to be really cool. Let's open up and see what's inside. Here we go. We have our instructions. We have our straws and utensils. We have the thing that holds it, and then that's where you use the jet spray. And we have this Kool-Aid that was made in 1993, so it expired in 1996. So I'm definitely not going to use this, guys. It actually even has the whole packaging, too, on it. And here is the main unit that holds it. Now we're going to clean it up, put it all together, and I'll be right back. Now let's take a closer look at the drink fountain. We have our scooper, we have our straws, and we have our cup lids. And on the top, we have our jet spray action little thing. And then we have our cup with cup holder on the side. And then right here, if you do that, the drink will come out. In the directions manual, there are some really cool recipes. So we're gonna do Happy Meal Drink recipe number two and Happy Meal Drink recipe number three. So for the first recipe, I'm gonna use 7-Up or Sprite, orange juice, and cherry Kool-Aid powder. First, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the top off there, put that to the side. Let's open up our 7-Up. We're gonna take this and measure one and a half. And pour it. Now, put that to the side. Let's do our orange juice. Another six ounces of orange juice. Put six ounces of orange juice. Now we take the scooper that you get. And you get one of the large scoops of your Kool-Aid, cherry Kool-Aid, sweetened. And you put it in there. Oh, that looks good. Now, now we put this back on. Now you do the jet spray action. And you can see the air is coming out to mix it. Now we're going to try it out. We put our cup down there. We push it against it. And it's coming out. It smells really good. It smells like a Hawaiian punch. Now we're going to put our lid on. And we put our straw on. And we're ready to try it. Here we go. Let's try it. Oh wow. That's actually okay. I didn't actually think it was going to taste that good. It's a really good fruit punch I would say. Now the next recipe we're going to be making a cherry cola. 
We have our cherry Kool-Aid powder, and we have some Pepsi. Add 12 ounces of Pepsi. Now do one large scoop of cherry Kool-Aid mix. Whoa, that looks really good. Is it going to stop? Is it going to stop? It stopped. Oh, that smells so good. I can't wait to try this. Now let's put this back on. Now we'll do our jet spray action. Now let's try out the cherry cola. It looks and smells amazing. Let's put our lid on and try it out. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. That is a lot better than I thought it was going to be. That's better than normal cherry Pepsi. Wow. Tastes more like a cherry Coke, but it is really good. You should definitely try this recipe. Between the two drinks that we tried from the booklet, I would definitely go with the cherry cola. It was a lot better than I thought it would be, so I'm definitely going to go with that one. This machine was really fun. I definitely recommend people should try it. And that's it. See you later. Bye.